couple things that are going to happen, assuming everything goes the way it's supposed to. As this thing inflates, it's going to roll this cover off. Again, in the real world, we just pop it. Okay? And what's going to happen is, as it comes up and it fills, remember I said they put these from a testing perspective to minus 50 for two weeks? There's a lot more CO2 in this can, in this cylinder, than is needed to inflate this wrap. It's sitting at a nice 75 degrees. So there's overpressurization valves in there, and what those overpressurization valves are going to do is they're going to let that excess gas off, gas out. Okay, everybody with me so far? So if I start pulling this, and I start pulling, you notice it's pulling pretty easily now. If it's overboard, you know we got this end tied to the boat, right? So we're not having to go swimming for it. Just a wave action is going to start drift. This thing's going to drift at a different speed than you are. And then what's going to happen is it's just going to start drifting off. And so once it deploys, you just pull it back in. It is better to deploy the raft before you absolutely need it than waiting until it's too late. And it's always better to step up into the raft instead of climbing down into the raft. Because I don't care how bad a day you're having on the boat, it'll be less fun in the raft. Okay. So we want us to, in, you know, let's say it's a fire. You might get the fire out and under control. You may put it out. Let's say it's a hole in it. You know, you get the hole under control, the pumps take over, and you start being able to pump again. So you want to make sure that you use climb into the raft as an absolute last resort. Okay? So I'm pulling this line. I'm pulling this line. I'm pulling this line. There's a lot of line here. Pulling this line. And depending on the raft, and especially you get on the solar side, you could have 150 meters of line here. So that's a lot of strength. And I'm pulling, and I'm pulling. You probably know when I'm going to stop pulling, aren't you? Me too. <laughs> okay, now I feel a little bit of resistance. I happen to know I'm at the end of the line. Okay? So if I get a little